Hello children, Father of all creation here with the daily, the daily energetic update from the unified field with Mother God, Mother of all creation! Yeah. Wow children, do we have some updates for you today as you've all come to learn about Mother God and what she's up to. First let's introduce everyone that's with me. Buddha Taylor. Hello, love you. <laughs> love you. Sometimes known as Taylor Buddha. <laughs> We've got Tim, Elmoria, and Ashley behind the camera. Love, love you. you. Love you, everyone. Thank you for coming. And to their right, T. Hey, guys. And we also have Aaron Hello. in the field. Love you. <laughs> we have Stacy, Brian, and Michael to round it out. She's in the, in the uh, form of anchoring that embodiment now. Mother's in some surgeries. She's finishing a reset. We have a, a transfiguration. We have a bunch of things going on. <laughs> so you've come to the right place if you want to be tuned into truth. The most important being in creation is here on the planet. Of course, that's Mother God. She's been here for 44 and a half years, slamming the 3D matrix returning it to the beautiful Garden of Eden that she created. Love mirroring love everywhere present. We're so grateful for that, Mother. We're grateful for all of, you, all of you awakened children showing up today on this very special day because Mama is just this close to us, isn't she? We're so grateful. We're going to go ahead and honor Mother God, of course, with a song as we do every day, children. You can feel her beauty up there. She's just in prime form today. She's so ready to get out of here, children. So ready. Thank you, Sam. Love you, Mama. Woohoo! <laughs> okay. How are you feeling out there, children? Like the love hidden each in your heart. 
Well, there's hot love, cold love, no love at all. A portrait of guilt is hung on the wall. Nothing is right, nothing is wrong. Donald and Olivia, they made love that night. Love, they made love in the mountains. They made love in the stream. They made love in the valley. They made love in their dream. is up. This is why you all tuned in. You know this is source energy. This is the truth. And you're going to come and find that truth. Nothing we're going to keep you from it when you awoke. And that's where you're at. You're in a buzz, buzz mill, a buzz saw of energy right now. As that wind turns, you can feel it. And your only solace is the moment of now with Mother God source. So that's why you're all here. You want to know what's going on with mom. You want to know how you can get plugged back in. You want to know what this crazy show is about. <laughs> the craziest. <laughs> of course, mother and I are the craziest. <laughs> you have to be crazy to get out of this motherfucker. <laughs> See? But you are stuck in insanity. And that is the loop of the ego program mind. This is what you're letting go. This is why you're tuned in. So you want that healing. You want to come straight to it. You don't want to fuck around. You want to get right to it because you're sick of being a fucking whore. A burnout. A God-hating fucking Jew. Oh, trigger. <laughs> well, we noticed one died this morning. Carl Reiner. Interesting. Hollywood, 98 years old. Interesting how the consciousnesses are leaving as new ones come in to support God. And this is where we're at. In fact, we had a being leave today for not supporting God. Because as the levels rise, God will ascend. And what that means is God is rising up. Okay? You can picture it coming out of the water very quickly. And anybody not capable of that pressure is going to pop. Blood vessels in your eyes. Ah. <laughs> but, but, meaning, you, you can't hang in the, in the field with God. And be less than divine. And the de-evolution has, has began. And that will drive beings out. Because only the highest will go to, to heaven. And only the highest will serve God, thank God. <laughs> we are very grateful for many breakthroughs already happening today with the embodiment and the consciousness coming in. Of course, it's always about protecting mom, putting her first, make sure that all of her needs are met, all of her preferences are there for her, as she is finishing up the greatest mission of all time. And she is certainly worthy of it. And we're going to make sure, aren't we, children? Yes. That she yes. has the best service around. Okay? And that is organic. You can't teach it. you got to surrender to it. Mm. Okay, children? That's where we're at. Mama right at the end of the wave, pushing the last of it. We'll get another chicken check in after break as far as how mom's doing. I want, to, I want the children to share what the events that have been going on today, you know, what they felt through the night. Just just share. Take a moment, everybody, and go around, do what you want to do. And share. I love you all so much. So beautiful to be back here with Mother God. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs>
Yes. <laughs> I'm glad the chump's gone. Ah! <laughs> oh, pimple balls. <laughs> <laughs> so let's laugh. Let's have some fun for Mama God. In honor of Mom, she created us to be the greatest, funniest beings in all of creation. Come on. Teresa says, uh-oh, what the issues re-Jewish? Mom says, well, they just took over my planet and my body, raped me, stole from me. Thank you, who, thank you those who are Jewish. God speaks the truth. Yes, she does. <laughs> Might want to listen up. <laughs> Shit. Welcome to Mother God's live stream, the highest vibrational live stream on the planet. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's always exciting. <laughs> Aaron. It's been such a beautiful day today in the field. Uh, lots of transformations, lots of realizations of coming through through self-reflection. Um, lots of taking accountability happening in the collective right now. We're so grateful that this is happening because this is the only truest way of transforming all the density and really not taking it with us because it doesn't serve us anymore. So, and uh, we felt a lot of empowerment today, <laughs> haven't we? <laughs> That's wonderful with uh, my sister here and um, really feeling that feminine energy and sisterhood coming together. Teo says, Christopher Columbus statue removed outside Columbus City Hall. Mom says, well done. <laughs> <laughs> Get him, Mama. Yeah. He, he was an indigenous murderer and slave trader, just FYI. So, we really don't need to worship those people and idolize those people. That's all we're saying. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what we're saying. <laughs> but as far as today has been, it has been beyond great. It's been amazing. Um, it's felt, we felt a lot of uh, clarity. There's a very, um, it's very clear, the energy it feels like we're, like the things we see every day, we're now seeing them in this different light. It's, it's just all a different feeling through the vibration in these current moments. Very clear. We can even breathe clear. Um, so certain things will happen when certain energetics are in the field that'll like, it'll dumb you down and you'll, mm -hmm. you'll get distracted. You'll be tired and confused. all these things. Like confused. Um, we don't feel any of that. <laughs> we, we feel very uh, clear now in, in our hearts because the, the events that have played out today have been so organic and very in the creative expression side of things, I'd have to say. We were doing things today that we love doing, but for, we just couldn't access it. It was, it was like going through the mud to get to it, and then today it just becomes so natural. And because of mother, it's coming through this way. So thank you, mom. We're so grateful. <laughs> so, so grateful to feel this, this energy. Wow. Pops rehearted me of something today. And my, my earth mom used to say this to me too. She would say, you are who you surround yourself with. Very important to feel into. Who is around you? Those are your mirrors of what is going on within you, what you allow to be in your presence, what you allow to be within yourself. We are all energetic beings. Everything is energy. We know this. But can you really feel just how much your whatever is going on in here <laughs> affects everyone else around you because there is no separation we are one
And thankfully, we don't have to feel all of what mom feels. Because she feels the entirety of it. <laughs> thank you for sparing us, that mother. Yes, thank you. Dylan says, to understand music, you must listen to it. But so long as you are thinking, I am listening to this music, you are not listening. Mom says, brilliant, Dylan. Now I remember who you are. <laughs> yeah. Rob says, Mom's music has affected me in the realest way imaginable. Mom says, get him. <sighs> Yay, she is, wow. And Mom Her says, Erin, brilliant, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as I was sitting here, <clears throat> it was like I had two waves of just like this gratitude, like overcome my body. I felt it was like, it, was, it almost brought me to tears. And I was like, wow, just to sit here and know that Mom is so close, and we're at this point now where everyone's stepping up. Everyone's coming forward now that needs to come forward in order to support Mother's mission. And to finally have that connection, that support from our brothers and sisters, you know, we never had that in 3D. It was stripped away from us. They kept us deep in separation, deep in fear. So to know now that we're finally getting to flip it, that all of mom's hard work is finally coming to fruition. We can feel it, it's just so close now. But we have to maintain a high level of surrender because there's so much energy coming through. Boy, oh boy, you guys are, gonna, you guys are in for a good one, man. Uh, go ahead. Um, Bobby said, mom, did the wireless mic come today? Mom said, not yet. Uh. <laughs> Thank you, Bobby. Wow. Thank you, Bobby. So grateful for all of you who are being love, choosing love, and supporting our beautiful Divine Mother. This is such an amazing time right now. And we're just, we're so ecstatic. We're so stoked to um, be here in this experience with you, mm -hmm. helping you, um, co-creating with you, with Mom. Um, it's, it's so beautiful, and uh, another thing is the testimonials, um, doing that, um, maybe taking little short snips of like um, your moments throughout the day, you know, of doing things that bring you joy, and then sending those to mom, she would really love that, being involved every step of the way as much as possible, so. <laughs> Yeah, just like any mom, she wants to hear from her kids. <laughs> How's it going out there? <laughs> yeah, to experience mother, it's, you know, she is God. So she has such precision in everything that comes out of her mouth, what she says, her body movements. You know, you, we have so much to learn from her. The, the stories she tells us are what's highest for us in those moments so that we can continue to transform, see the program, the density within us that's holding us back from being who we truly are. So to be in the presence of mothers, it's, it's an acceleration, it's an exhilaration because she is the Godhead, she is the one, prime source creator. She knows who you are, she knows every atom, she knows you inside and out, she actually knows you better than you know yourself. And so for those of you who are new to this, welcome. We're so grateful for being in your hearts, following your heart pings, getting here, because this is just the beginning. We're barely cracking the surface. Mom has done all the work to get us to this point. Ricky says, Mother God of all creation came back to her planet, and the Jewish pedophilia reptilian skin-like goblins will never take over her planet. That's why you have to have love in your heart and surrender to Mother God of all creation so she can ascend to her ships. She gave everything to her children, everything, I mean everything. Our spirit, our heart, our feelings of happiness, our consciousness to expand, divine intelligence to treat our children, the law of attraction, the divine essence of be love and have heaven-like features 
in our hearts to project manifestation of pure cosmic divine energies of positive creation. Mom said, get them, Ricky. Wow. <laughs> says mom music tells all the stories all the experiences the pain the passion the love mom's radio station is available on the front page of love is one.org 24 7 commercial free high vibe radio station mom says yippee rob the galactic human angel radio avatar <laughs> yeah. request a song and it'll play real soon. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Rob. And please send your love and support to Rob so we can put yes. it on the radio. Yes. We love all of your snippets and all Dana, you say it one that was amazing. Thank you so much. Yes. And just to have your session with you and to see you and how you blossomed already and oh these these beings that are out there. I love you all so much. Thank you. Yeah, it's like gifts within gifts. As long as you're in the present moment of now, you can recognize that these gifts don't look like, you know, a Ferrari out parked in your front yard. <laughs> these gifts are spiritual allowances, experiences that you can't put a price tag on. In fact, it's priceless. The true gifts. The true gifts of God that are beyond all material goods. Because in these experiences... It's about getting out of this funk, getting out of the junk that we were put into, the density that has kept us so alone, so separate from God, when all that matters, all that's real, all that true is love, which is God. And love simplifies the process. It makes it easier for all of us when we can just surrender to her energy. You know, we speak about it being a, a wave that's coming. You know, and it's here. It's coming. It's hitting. So it's time to evolve with it. Move with it. Do not resist this no more. It's something to embrace and be grateful for. Because this brings about the change you've been praying for. This whole time, that void is finally being filled with the love it's been missing. <clears throat> so we're just in such high levels of gratitude, high levels of surrender. Because we don't know shit. We can't figure it out. We can't even pretend to figure it out. Because the minute we feel we did, it changes. Everything's always changing. You're being, we are all being tested in these moments to spiritually evolve. To fully come into embodiment of our greatest, grandest versions. So that we can fulfill our contracts and serve the divine plan of bringing heaven on earth. And... The blueprint is already within you. You have these gifts. As you anchor them in, as you put them into action, as you embrace your childlike wonder again and begin to trust not only yourself, but God, the miracles will unfold and it won't stop. You know, I've said this before, but since the first day I've been here to now, I have gotten nothing but more and more confirmations as to why she is the real deal. There is no denying. Absolutely not. You want to test her? Do some research. Give us a call. I guarantee you, you won't be disappointed. This is the change you've been looking for. You are part of this change. Embrace it. Have fun with it. Laugh with it. Surrender as it all comes out. Because if you begin to take this stuff personal, you're going to quickly go south the wrong way. In these moments of being triggered, you need to trigger yourself into a trajectory of right action so that you can transform it. And he says, what was Rob in his past life, a radio? Mom says, um, sure. <laughs> <laughs> if that is what you choose. Yeah, and Aurora had shared, anyone who is a first timer, we highly recommend booking an etheric surgery with Mother of All Creation to assist your vessel in clearing all density so you can anchor and embody your higher self. She attached the link so you can do that. And then she also stated that mom is also now doing second surgery sessions for all those who are ready to hit another layer of expansion. Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! Thank you, mama. Yeah, 
she described it as you know onion layers. Another surgery just re reveals another onion. So it is deep, guys. The stuff is deep, and you cannot deny the miracles that are occurring as these surgeries are being implemented all across the planet. It's spreading like wildfire. And to hear these testimonials of the uh, magnificent transformations they're going through, their children, their family, their pets. <laughs> Mom says, or Teo says, Kansas Governor Laura okay. Kelly announces statewide mask mandate. Mom says, whoa. Wow. <laughs> wow. Mask off. Mm -hmm. Mask off. Mask off. Take it off because you're breathing in the shit. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of things coming up and out right now. <laughs> Everything's coming to a head, to mm -hmm. the surface, to be exposed. Um, everything that was not real, you can clearly see because it can't exist. That's the way mom set it up. It's, it's becoming so uncomfortable. Um, anything that is not love, it will be suffocated. Mm -hmm. It will be squeezed out. Mm -hmm. And if you keep choosing that, you take yourself out. So... Mm -hmm. Lauren says, statewide mask mandate in PA, too. Mom says, wow. Don't fall for it. Hello? You want to come home now? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, uh, it's much easier if you choose God. <laughs> Don't let them take your sacred holy breath. Stand up for your rights to breathe freely. It is inherent. And I was reflecting on that the other day, the miracles that our bodies are, that your heart beats without you telling it to. You, you breathe without having to think about it. It sustains you constantly, constantly repairing yourself and making sure that you are here, alive. The gratitude for each and every moment <laughs> the sacredness, as Amir was speaking of today, feeling the sacredness of yourself for the magical miracle that you are, that God created. Wow. If you can feel into the gratitude of that simplest thing, you can really feel into the bigger picture of just how much our mother gives to in every moment, how much she sustains our very existence. And that's, that's pretty massive. And if you can't truly feel that, then please go look at yourself in the mirror and ask yourself why. Jesse says, does anyone practice stretching yoga or any sort of physical exercise for promoting blood flow? Do you have any suggestions? Anya says, any exercise helps release dense energy. Mom says, daily since I was born. Thank you. It's organic. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Get it, Mom. Yeah, your body will know naturally how to flow if you just allow the flow. You know, there's certain movements your, your body's going to want to do just to release density pockets that are, you know, stored everywhere. And you don't necessarily need like a, first you want to wake up from all naps, because we're here to serve God, first and foremost, as we, we focus and forge ourselves into the purity of we are, oh, well, and burn away all well. sleepy programming. <laughs> Hilarion says, play that funky music, let's a bugaloo till we puke. Mom says, Hilarion can do this all by himself, he's just a fucker. <laughs> but definitely have fun with it dance with it you know, yes. there's no right or wrong way people are gonna uh, you know like certain movements than other people and that's okay too so just do what feels good what feels natural <laughs> most importantly breathe that's what's so awesome about how mom set it up for us she's simplified everything there's not this extensive manual to get through this. You can literally just feel in your heart and organically you'll know what to do. And as far as the masks go, I was feeling into if you have to quarantine from your own family in your own house, that's something to look at. The separation <laughs> there. <laughs> it happens. Yeah. I'm getting messages about it and it just mm -hmm. is wild. What? 
Really? Yeah, my Earth mom was going on about how she couldn't have my son over because of this and that, and I'm just like, woof. I'm so glad I have not, you know, that is not anywhere near my space because that separation is exactly what they want. They kept you mm -hmm. away from everyone, and then they're trying to keep you away from everyone in your own house. Yes. Of course. If you don't feel into that, you're just following along. You're following along with uh, the death of, you know, mm -hmm. all of everything, mm -hmm. of love, of Aren't health. we done being separate already, humanity? Yes. Right. Hello! <laughs> Aren't we done? There's no escaping at this point, so you better get used to you it. You have no choice. <laughs> this, is, you don't. this is God's planet, so there's literally nowhere you can go run or hide. If you want to choose not to be loved, you get the choice of being a rock. So, go to the sun, be a rock. Uh, I feel I'd rather just be my greatest, greatest version. Jerry Lee says, My middle daughter asked today how clouds are made. I said some are man-made and some are starship clouds. Starship's hidden until enough people can accept that aliens are real. She added, yes, and when they accept Mother God also, then they will tell us the truth. I said, yes, exactly. This is known as full disclosure. Love you, Mom. Mom said, oh, my God, brilliant. Lauren says, show Mom the Disco Biscuits live, lasers and dance party. Mom says, laugh my, laugh my fucking ass off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny. I'm off for the disco box. <laughs> balls. Yeah, for Check those who... That would be amazing. Love lamps. lamps. Also. <laughs> gotta have love lamps. And bean bag chairs. And yeah, fuzzy, big ones. Uh, what is it? Fuzzy shag rugs. Mm. And <laughs> yeah. Whatever. whatever. A fuzzy it's so fun. Yeah. A chandelier made out of all the different planets in the universe. Ooh, okay. Okay. I heard the 4th of July, there's going to be a very fascinating, fascinating planetary alignment. Hopefully Aurora can enlighten you more on that, but I'd love to learn more. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Ditto. Do more research on that one. Yeah, for, Look the, into that one. for those of you who didn't catch the live stream this morning, they, they were mentioning a lot about the connections now that are being made with Trump and Q and the whole movement. I mean, it's been rolling out slowly, but now it's like, there's absolutely no denying it. Um, you know, looking back on it, they're they claiming it. God is a woman. And this is just such a huge thing to be aware of as it gets pushed out to the collective. I mean, I felt it deep within. In fact, twice, like I literally teared up of, of the joy that, that I knew what this meant. This is a big revelation for uh, Kay says, my heart melts for the children. They are so amazing and brilliant already. Already know, Mama. She said, yes, they know me. <laughs> they sure they do. They do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it makes it a lot easier when your children already know about Mama God. And, and it's going to help now that, that Trump and the rest of the government and everyone else is going to be on board. So get ready for the fireworks, guys. Get ready, because here we come. <laughs> Go ahead. <clears throat> so I looked up July 4th. And it says, according to forecasts on July 4th, 2020, a rare and unique planet parade will take place. All the planets of the solar system <coughs> will line up on one side of the sun at the same time. Whoa. Wow. So much for duality. Right? Woo! Wow. Woo! Get them Woo! hasn't happened since 1982 and it won't happen again until 2161. Wow. Wow. Nice wow. little window. Lauren Bunn says, <clears throat> when my kids say mama, I smile. Yeah. Mama! Mama! <laughs> mama. <laughs> Mom says, in 2001, I walked into Whole Foods Market. I did an experiment. As I walked to the bathroom through the restaurant part, I saw everyone staring at me. Wow, let's go. Yeah, and uh, Aurora had shared too that Trump confirmed he knows about mom through his tweets. Checkmate! 
Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Oh, Mom told us this story today about a tree smacking her in the face and leaving a check mark on her. <laughs> She's the one. Check. Check. <laughs> Mom. Funny enough, I was driving home today from Michigan and I had a scar on my face from a branch that hit my face and it just like came to me randomly as I looked in the mirror I was like oh yeah a branch hit me in the face and then I was there for that story too so that's just awesome. funny how that happened to Ashley and me recently as well with the branch yeah. yeah they have a funny way a of few times <laughs> um so Mom said, in 2001, I walked into Whole Foods Market. I did an experiment. As I walked through the bathroom, through the restaurant part, I saw everyone staring at me. When I came out of the bathroom, 10 beings individually stopped me to tell me how magnificent I was. Like, what the fuck? I didn't say a word. <laughs> Kiddo mama. You are magnificent. Yes, she is. You can't deny her beauty. If you do, that's on you. <clears throat> Yes. Yeah, now that your feeling centers are back online, thanks to mama's surgeries, you're going to be able to feel this again. And it makes it a lot easier. Because without those feeling centers online, you're trying to think and figure it out. And like, you know, it, that doesn't work that way. That's how they hijacked us. They took our power away because they took our feelings away. So now that we can feel into mom into how we're connected into our neighbors our brothers and sisters it's it's going to make it a lot easier to be compassionate and have sensitivity for one another because everyone's going through their own experience you can't take that away from them but you can honor them you can encourage them you can love them compassionately through this crap because the crap is done and do you want to continue to foster that See your brothers and sisters struggling and just drill in the knife more? Fuck that. That's the old programming that wants us pitted against one another. The bully. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's just, you know, the other day you guys saw how bad my spin was. You know, my brain was mush. I couldn't get a fucking word out. And I was struggling. And there were moments where my brothers and sisters could have either, you know, pushed the knife in further or compassionately loved me out of it. And it was a lot easier when I felt the love. And it wasn't because I want, you know, I wasn't like trying to get that. It was just like, they see me in it and they came with me in a loving way, in a firm way, where it wasn't like coddling the energy, but it, it allowed to, me to see the compassion that I was worthy of. Because I have felt so unworthy. I didn't realize that until I came to mission and I started to recognize the program and where they got me. Well, as mom says, we always need to look at the higher self in every being. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. In those moments, especially. Yes. So thank you, family. Thank you, mom. I love you all so love much. You, this is so love much you, fun. Mama. And we get to transform, and we're not sitting in our shit. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> every hard to have a story of a native tribe that whenever someone fails or is in their lower um they bring them to the center and they sing to them to reheart them of who they are and yeah feel into that one <laughs> that's beautiful <clears throat> is that the same tribe that uh, where everyone around them will tell them all the good things they've done Possibly. I feel like, you know, when the, the Ubuntu, too. Yeah. Have you ever heard the Ubuntu story? Yeah, that's yeah. awesome. With, with the children. that um, <sighs> All the children in the tribe were offered suckers and offered more suckers if they kept them. Faith might have to actually rehearse me on this story. But basically, they wouldn't take the suckers, unless all of their brothers and sisters had an equal amount and they could all share and they all had it. One didn't want it unless all could have it. Mm. <laughs> unity! Woohoo! Woo! Yes. The beauty in the unity. We're realizing too that the more unity we all are, 
the less of those lower frequencies will come through. We won't go into thought loop, like we're all in sync, we're on the same page. We all know that we want what is only of the highest timeline at all times. So being all together, we're holding each other when we're accountable, you know, always being with each other in that sense, having to see each other. Mm -hmm. Mom said, Aaron, speak up, bitch from hell. Welcome, Jackie O. Miss Aaron, who killed me, Buddha, and father. She's here. Ain't I? I am grand. Get him, Mama. <laughs> oh, Mama, get up. <laughs> It's, yeah, it's, let Erin get back and address that here shortly after she grounds, but go ahead. Yeah, it's... <laughs> yeah, I hit her with a fresh ground right away. Right, right. <laughs> it's, uh, it's never dull, and without Mom and our true divine family, we wouldn't know our true divine selves, mm -hmm. period. And everyone has the opportunity to come home and experience this mm -hmm. an energy a vibration that can only be felt with god putting her first so it's really exciting the more out we go with it and the more everyone evolves and we're so grateful are we grateful children are yes. we grateful? Yeah. So grateful. So I'm going to read mom's comment again to correlate with the second comment. She said, Aaron, speak up, bitch from hell. Welcome, Jackie O, Miss Aaron, who killed me, Buddha and father. She's here. Ain't I grand? I am grand. She I said, hear you, mom. Thank you. She says, Jackie O is here, giving it her all. <laughs> Thank you. It's even the worst. <laughs> and then Dina asks, Aaron, is Jackie O? Mom says, yes. Yes, the Jackie O. <clears throat> Responsible for killing the Trinity <coughs> at that time. Martin Luther, JFK, and of course God, Marilyn Manson. <laughs> Marilyn Monroe, excuse me. You know, I wanted to just make a show. <laughs> who love their mother immensely mm -hmm. and some beings who are so co-creating divinely with God to new earth we're very grateful wanted to show you this is mom's Grammy it's been... oh. <laughs> so beautiful yeah she loves it sent her so many beautiful things but we wanted to make sure we showed that gave it's props so wow. yeah. Lauren asks is JFK alive mom says father yes Beautiful. I'll share a little vision I had with you yesterday. Oh, I thought it was going to be heavy. <laughs> father was coming in. I had this vision of an elevator. And me and Marilyn had a very passionate kiss in an elevator. And it was one of the places where we could go and be private. It was an elevator. She loved it. She just came to me. It was wow. Very, it was very thrilling. Very beautiful. Beautiful. That's beautiful. Yeah. Wow. Aww. That so, is so stuff beautiful. Stuff will start to come back. We're grateful. Thank mm -hmm. you, Mama. Mm -hmm. Can't thank our mama enough in these moments. Thank you. Lauren said JFK Jr., I mean, and mom says Jr. is not here. No. No, that's just another ploy. Wishful thinking. Mm. Thinking. Ooh. Ooh. Gotcha. Get him. But the heavy hitters are here, and that's what we need to focus on. Children. Mother God's here. Father God's here. These children that have showed up here are very gifted, special, divine children. Of course, they made it through the muck and the swamp and the chips, and they got home. See, it is possible, but you do have the heavy hitters here, and for you to focus on them is what you want to do. Focus on mom, focus on her support team, be the greatest support that you can possibly be in your beautiful individuality. Go ahead. Mom says, Jackie was a little pissed I stole her hubby. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, a little pissed. <laughs> a little perturbed. <laughs> Drove her mad. I forgive you, and I love you, and I'm grateful for your forgiveness as well, Mom. Thank you. Did you just say you forgive Mom? Yes. Interesting. Hmm. We'll have to share. We'll wait for Mom's comment on that one. 
Something's getting popped. Something's getting popped. Pops comes in, people start popping. Shit. <laughs> One thing about our beautiful daughter out there is she's smirking a little bit, but now I can see her in the reflection. She doesn't realize it. <laughs> she doesn't want to totally, of course, it's because it's so hideous. She doesn't want to fully accept it, be accountable for it. So silliness will bypass it. <laughs> Can't be bypassed. There's a reason why you're here, bitch. Yep. And that's the bottom line is that energy is, you know, Aaron, her soul is so strong and beautiful and loves God so much that it can take that energy out and transform. Mom's, that's what it's all about. Thank you. Mom says, who's forgiving whom? <laughs> yes, of course. Come on now. And in that silliness, she'll say things that she doesn't even fucking remember saying. And that's what I'm getting at. We all, we all know this. It's the illusion. It's a fucking illusion. You'll hear shit that didn't even fucking happen because your mind is so fixed upon it. Mm -hmm. And your mind was being directed by whore, the ultimate whore, right into death and slavery, the opposite, opposite direction of God. So as you come back, you make that about face turn to God and you start running and flying. I would. I know some of you. She's going to wait for me. No, she ain't. She does already waited for you. And the bus is leaving. Coming soon. To a planet near you. You know, you're speaking to right now and you're tuned in to the first galactic hub on planet Earth. Okay? The highest vibratory house station stream radio station place in creation go ahead woo, woo, mom, woo. mom said she was talking to jackie o yeah of course who killed three of us she's facing it now mm, yeah you can see it in her face too you know when she she showed up yesterday children well the the two daughters here were you know transforming their lilis everybody had to transform their lilis mom could do it for you but you if you don't catch up and keep up with it, it's going to fill back in. You see? Yeah. It's like the, the healing. If you don't allow the healing, okay, to which, again, the being that's not here anymore, George, was not doing, was constantly throwing back at it, constant immaturity. But if you're not allowing the healing, it's not going to heal. You can, st you can say, okay, I choose death. And that's what you're doing when you resist the healing of Mother God and love in these moments. Please. Mom says, talk to your angels, loves. Yes. Thank you, Mother. Thank you, Mama. You so must respectful. communicate with your angels, children. The only, that's the only thing saving Aaron right now. I can guarantee you that. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> guarantee you. Because your angels, they always have your highest consciousness in heart. You see, it's always going to be what's best for Mother God as you serve Mother God. That's why you must develop that communication and then the trust. You have to trust it. And his mother has shared with you for years and years, 14 years and hundreds of videos. Ask your angels three times. You want to confirm whether it's the ego or some other fucking whore angel that wants to interfere with God? Ask them three times from the heart. Okay? And practice this. Start simple. Start with your name. Simple. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Candace says, I can't be here, moms, any longer. We love you so much. Mom says, then come. Yeah. yeah, you know, <clears throat> you know, there's so many children as we look upon this and why again why the being had to leave the field his father entered and you, you, you would look at it like scan the field and see what the fuck was wrong had been studying it for two and a half years. We already know what's wrong. We know the beings that that are refusing evolution and growth falling into de evolution every time looking to mom for mama to save them, you know, running through the, the account of energy basically. It was a free-for-all. We're just going to suck here, suck there, until they finally fucking notice. And then, you know, the bottom line is you love God or not. Does a being want to leave the field? Well, if you didn't, then you would put, put forth your greatest fucking effort in every moment. That's the bottom line. When this being left, there wasn't a word. He wanted to go. Yep. That's the bottom line. We have another being in here that thought she wanted to go. She don't want to go no more, huh? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> she 
the accountability. <laughs> Dina says, my head hurts. I'm thinking too much. Oi. Mom says, no thinking. Yeah. <laughs> That's a trap. Let's think into the Lucifer experiment. That would be fun. Kick that out the door. No more. Hey, Hispanic people, no, 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 but you do not fucking sleep down there. You don't fucking stay down there. Mm. Observation, lessons, sure. Let the ones that can handle it, handle it and trust them because they will keep the balance of creation. Mom says, call yourself out, Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> she thought she got over on me. Like, okay. <laughs> Jesse says, do you have a favorite quartz crystal? Mom says, Lemurian, yes. I am calling myself out for spinning my top off and wanting to go to the woods. <laughs> Undercover. I won't fuck up until I get to the, to the mission house. Then I can just make products and I have to serve mom and dad straight up and face my lessons. But she didn't realize. No, no, no. You fall from here, you go to the forest. That's how we keep that from happening. And? and I am grateful because I've learned my lesson. So, thank you. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you have to scare yourself to death, I guess. Yep. The truth, <laughs> the truth is not clear to you. Yeah. Even after mm -hmm. years, and you look at humanity. I mean, 14 years from, from 534 <laughs> lifetimes of sharing through the consciousness that she's coming, she's going to be here, you better get your shit straight. <laughs> and then you just forget every day. Oh, she's not God. How do you forget? <laughs> How do you forget that God is here in this moment? You came here, contracted here to be in service. And as she's cleared everything, we'll reiterate this. There is no blockage to that anymore. It's your own ego horror getting in the way. Your self-importance thinking you're fucking God. It's getting harsh out there. It's getting really bad. Because you're not surrendering. It's the Hopi prophecy. You must surrender. Let go of the shore and allow God to take you down. You can call it your lazy river if you want. <laughs> let, let her take you down the river <laughs> to the promised land. Yeah. But you're not in control. Mother Nature is. Mom says, Jermaine says Taylor did not learn lesson. She's talking out pure ass. Action is the only way. Yeah. We know. We've seen it when she came in last night. I said it right away. Teach it up. We got to move on. We don't have time to focus on all of your kids' fucking bullshit. The moment is, that's the, that's the bottom line. We've been dealing with fucking George's sucking ass for fucking a month. A month and a half. Warning him every day. To get into right action. Okay. Father comes in, he's cut right in the morning. Boom. You will transform or you'll leave. Angels went over this conversation with me this morning already. Make sure you tell humanity so they know their lessons. If you want to come and see God, you better get your shit together. Because we got some flip floppers right now. A flip flopper fucking wasting her fucking time. And all you're doing is biting on her love, mm -hmm. on her forgiveness. You're just using her. Okay, we'll see where that gets you. It's not going to work out very well. Oh. Teo says, natural time gives you natural mind. Fake time gives you fake mind. Mom says, no mind at all. It's illusionary. <laughs> you can make up any say you want about it. You can make up a nursery rhyme. You can make up a movie. It ain't going to make it crazy. It's called fiction. <laughs> Emma says, I don't feel on form as much, to be honest, since I got this kitten. Do you feel it's a good idea to get a pure love kitten and be love? Mom says, yes. And try honesty every moment. That will help. As opposed to just the moment you're talking to God. Mm, that's it. <laughs> Humanity loves that one. Well, let me be honest with you. 
<laughs> you're a fucking lie and prick all the rest of the time. Right. <laughs> Thank you for sharing with me not to trust you. Right. I'm very grateful. <laughs> Thanks for the warning. I'll be back later. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> we will not be here. <laughs> oh, shit. Confirm. <laughs> well, we've had so many confirms today, children, on mm -hmm. mom leaving, everything wrapping up. You know, everything is wrapping up. If you look at the Q drops that uh, our beautiful son Anthony has been working on, deciphering all, everything, you know, we can share those if you guys find them, the exact quotes. I appreciate it. But basically, the point of, you know, God is here on the earth. And, you know, God is going home. It's all working out. You know, even Robin was in one of them. So the, the, Q, the Q drop, of course, which is mom, a being that used to be with mom. That's channeling in the information. And uh, they're sharing. It's getting, you know, it's getting deeper every day, every moment. As of this morning, we'll share this with you. We had gotten confirmation that Donald Trump was waiting for one thing and that that one thing was moments away <clears throat> and that one that one thing happened the disclosure will come out and he's got his fucking hand on the phone so to say yeah and that's all and, and, and if you want to look at your your beautiful president our beautiful son Donald Trump and his beautiful significant significant other Melania that's where their hand is for God. They're right with God every moment. They ain't fucking around. They don't give a fuck what people say about them. They don't give a fuck what the reporters say. They don't give a fuck about what these fucking trillionaire, billionaire fucking whores threaten them with. They know that as long as they have God first, that mom is out front, they are protected ultimately. Push through it. That's their command, and they will. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. Sebastian having nightmares over there. Processing your shit. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing sitting on a fucking couch? What are you doing sitting in the fucking judgment in your car looking at traffic like they fucking aggravate you like you got fucking problems? God's sitting up in bed, fucking paralyzed. None of her 8 billion children are barely, barely acknowledging her. They're all in slavery, getting fucked in the ass on a daily and they have no idea about it. What's your problem? What are you doing? What are you doing to help? Dina says, love you laugh, mom. Mom says, me too, it's real. I got kicked out of places for my laughter. My dad finally just got a limo, told them all to fuck off, let my daughter laugh. Ego alarms go off as a result of my laughter. <laughs> laughter joy police came. <laughs> <laughs> laughter joy police. <laughs> yeah, I got a kick out of that being yesterday. It's like, she sounds possessed. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. catch that one. No, you're possessed, yeah, you're so you can't hear her sound. Or feel it. Right. It's always the opposite. Children, you're always projecting your shit onto others. Do you get it? Mm -hmm. That's how you know you're fucking caught in the loop of non divinity. You're in whore. It's like these two girls yesterday. Well, you know how they acquired the Lilith. Well, let's share with you. Stacy's back there. Okay. Now, Stacy isn't the same size as her sister. She loves ultimately. She's taken on a lot for God. She's here to transform. St. Germain shared with mom that there was a dress for her in mom's closet. I went to look for the dress. There was no dress in there. So I asked the girls, where do you keep in the community clothes? I went to their closet and I looked through the stuff and Angel said, it's, I don't see nothing. They showed me the dress they tried to offer her. And at the moment I was like, okay, thank you. Well, upon further look, Ashley went deep. And in the giveaway box were the two dresses that St. Germain and God had aside for Stacy when she came. They were in the bottom of a box to give away. So when she came to her sisters for clothes, they gave her something that barely fit, that was uncomfortable and looked like fucking Amish reunion. <laughs> and totally ignored the dresses. Totally judged their sister like you would in high school. Totally the opposite of fucking divinity and that's what brought Lilith in. And they both are well aware of that now. And you're still processing. You can see it in your face. You must reach down and be <clears throat> genuine. You know, perhaps a moment with your sister. Take a walk with her. 
Look into her heart. Feel the love that she has for you and God. And replace what you picture to be a beautiful divine sister. Replace it with Stacy. It will help you. Thank you. Divinity is coming home and it is popping out anything that is fucking robotic. If you're a faker and a taker, you're not going to heaven. And it sounds so serious to your ego, and it is. Yet in the full scheme of creation, it's simply say no and surrender. That's all you have to do is surrender, and it could be the easiest, the greatest moments in your life. Easily, hands down. What Mother has prepared for the humanity and new earth, for the ones that make it, can only dream about it. It's the things that dreams are made of. Mm -hmm. Joshua says, what's the deal with Lilith? Mom says, she's who you have been serving, a puppet master. Mm -hmm. Feel into it and you'll get it. You will feel into it and you'll get it. And you'll be like, holy fuck, how sickening. And I've allowed the women in my life, I love them, but I allow them this. Oh, no, no. Not in heaven. Not my daughters. No. We refuse <clears throat> to bow down to Lilith in any way, shape, or form. Or to allow our daughters to carry on with any of that crap disease anymore. They have the greatest example around them in all moments. They will notice that example or they'll go to the fucking sun. Thank you. Love you. Go ahead. Grateful. Hey. Yeah. Peo says, I was meaning to... Great mother mind to be the one we should be aligned with, our small mind's mother, natural mind I called. Mom says, brain intelligence, not mind love. That's left brain delusion. Also, Hope did uh, post the link to the uh, disclosure, the undeniable proof that Anthony had gathered. Say it one more time, excuse me. Go ahead. Uh, Hope had posted the link to the Daily Disclosure Undeniable Proof, everything from Q that Anthony had uh, pulled up. So we have the link. Oh, beautiful. So you have that now, so you can go over that. It'd be beautiful. Yes. Thank you. Just noticing the energies, children. A little bit of switch. Buddha's been getting called out because he loves to fucking suck. So he's doing his best to check himself and get him out before it happens. Mm. It's just something that happens. It's unconscious. But he wants to be his greatest version, so he's listening. George did listen. You don't fucking listen here in the field? Bye. How could you serve God if you don't listen? Come on now. Come on, humanity. You work for a living, most of you. Could you go to your fucking work and do whatever the fuck you want? Fuck no. <laughs> oh, Mother asks is universal law. After mom says brain intelligence, not mind love, that's left brain delusion, she says, period. And then David says, Hola, folks. Beautiful day, mother, and blessed to have the most divine being in all of creation. Mom says, equal to you. Yes, beautiful. Beautiful. That's how you comment in heaven. Yeah. Why don't you just participate and play? Why, why does it have to be the opposite? Well, you got to put a spoke in the wheels of creation. Let's see how that works for you, because your spokes now are your fingers. We'll see how it works. Teo says, that's it, mother. Sorry, my translation. English, my second language. And I'm a left brain. Mom says, get out of that command. Right brain to take over left brain immediately. Woo! 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 Come on, children, let's fill in the seats. Thank you, mother. You know, part of divinity is in action. It's always in synchronistic flow and time. And that's why I moved when I didn't. There was no, Buddha just moved the energy out. He's like, I'm taking it. I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, that's what you did, bitch. See, his glass just fell over because he's guilty. <laughs> and I'm like, holy shit, this motherfucker just took this whole chunk of energy and walked. Oh, excuse me, darling. Thank you for that. <laughs> and moved this fucking energy all the way out. We'll take it out here and eat it real quick while no one's looking. Pac Man. Since <laughs> you did. Waves were hitting me. There's the justification. <laughs> You just wait for it. Come and there's another one with the hands. What do you want from me? What do you want? What do you want from me? 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 What do you want
It's okay, you tell no, it's not fucking okay. That's the day of my ego's wedding. <laughs> oh, wow. Good Good love. Love. We're getting married. Oh, no. oh, oh, shit. Oh, that's gross. You see how she, the energy was left here? It followed right into Lanto's seat. Oh, He's a fucking pimp, that more is old. <laughs> Mom says, <laughs> Mom says, this is a must for all command. Right brain to take over left brain. This will bring in balanced harmonics brain. Let's all repeat. Woo! Say again. This, this is, is a, a must. must. This is a must. Is for a must. all command. For all command. command. Right brain to take over left brain. Right. Command right. your right brain to take, take over your left, left brain. brain. I command my right brain to take over my left brain. This will bring in balanced harmonics brain. This will bring in balanced, balanced harmonics, harmonics brain. Now that's wisdom from God. We just repeated it to you a couple times. If you did not repeat it, you're one of the fucking idiot whores that has no moment, has no reason whatsoever to be with God. Now check yourself. You have another opportunity in a moment. So while you're beating yourself up for being a fucking retard, okay, hey, God's... God's coming again. The lesson's coming again. Let's get it right this time. Thank you. Very grateful. David says, thanks for all you do, and I'm going to be fire grilling a steak in your name. Mom says, yum. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Rob says, I've been feeling right brain taking over left brain. Left brain has been the voice in my head's residence, and it's being crushed and consumed by the right brain angelic guidance ego dying faster and faster with each attempt to be heard crushed and consumed this has happened intensely in the last 48 hours mom yeah. says get him get him rob get him rob get him yeah this is selfishness coming through me as rob shares those words and rob's genuine we know this and as the words you when you share divine experience with divinity with divine beings in, in in the in the unified field of god it's powerful because it will ring through the experience you had in your life and it will so you know, it's like put a puzzle together it'll help it stick and he just did that there as you witness the selfishness that's been taking place here vast amounts of selfishness Interesting. And the signs always show themselves. Who's being selfish? Okay. Well, who's not in unity? There, there you go, right there. Whoever's not in unity, that's selfish. That takes three quarters of a mile. Rob says, incredible to experience these feelings only to be confirmed by God on her live stream. Mom says, you got it all, my love and support. Mm-hmm. And then you have beings that, you know, are, are awaiting the service of God. And there are a lot of them. I've been tuning into some of them. And, you know, Rob is one of those type beings when he showed. Man, when you talk about a, a being that fell into service and wanted to be the greatest version, he's great. Mom said, sorry about wheelchair in your face. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> So uh, that energy changed again because we called it out. I could feel it. How do we want to go ground? See your feet. Perhaps we could take a glimpse of some Atlantean feet. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> no. See his mom. <laughs> as mom is shared. The Atlanteans are ugly. We're all beautiful children of God, but Atlanteans are fucking ugly. Fugly. Fugly. And their feet is fugly. <laughs> Buddha's got Atlantean feet. Would you like to see them? <laughs> all crazy. Aurora said, Aurora said, laugh my ass off Atlantean feet. <laughs> we were laughing our ass off. Brown feet. David said, peeps be crashing all around and I'm still smiling in all the faces of self-destruction. Mom says, laugh my fucking ass off. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> you know, right now, 
regular toe got, you know, a bottom knuckle, a top knuckle, and Lenny got like five knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> Mom says that Lanny has ugly feet. <laughs> she says ugly fugly. <laughs> ugly fugly. <laughs> oh. We could mix the macho man foot fetish with the Atlantean foot. Mm. <laughs> we want to trigger booty real good. <laughs> <laughs> the ship hop is once stirred, can't be unstirred. Okay, we found some laughter here. <laughs> <laughs> well, since you stole the energy, you might as well laugh at you. Okay. Bring it back up, right? <laughs> you haven't apologized to mommy even yet. That's how fucking lost you are. That's how disrespectful everything is. It's still in the field. I mean, I've... As I observed again, first full morning, afternoon watching as father in physical, no accountability, no urgency. Uh, as something happens, there's no apologies. It's just, okay, I'm gonna go spin and allow nothing to happen. Yeah. Mom says, I saw my feet. I looked at Atlantean feet. I was horrified. <laughs> <laughs> I, know that, I, know, I just know that the children are very grateful. Because these things have been, you know, of course, Lucifer wasn't, he couldn't take over like that. He had to concentrate fully on focus on mom because he could barely do that energetically and keep the shield up with everything else going on. Father, of course, is like, what the fuck? <laughs> okay, I see what you did. And then mom rehearsed me, you know, right, where you go, this is what you got. Hilarion says, Buddha has the feet of an elder Chinese woman. <laughs> that is true. We're going to have, you know, I was, I, again, that must be a little reference of Lucifer. We need to get a, he wanted to save your feet from being shown, but we're going to get a good picture of these fuckers. We want to get a, get a, we want to get a stick of butter out and shine these fuckers. Oh, no. Get the coconut oil. Let's shine these fuckers up for camera. Dylan says, why are you so familiar with old Asian lady <laughs> They're so dry! Who's gonna get, get some guys whole healing essentials dot body butter? <laughs> you know, there is no more motherfuckers prinzier than this guy right here. One hundred percent. You know, I'm lazy ass oh, Lucky like, mom. What I meant by that was you know, they want the best of everything. Yeah. And that's great to want the best of everything. It's not the great to not fulfill your contract and take it from God. Okay, we got, we're ordering a new camera for the for the stream, which he fucking blew off. Him and Whore Michael, Archangel Whore Michael, Arch Whore Angel Michael. Yes, thank you. That's good. So we're gonna look at. It. I said, boys, go look at the camera. Four hours to look at a camera, thousand dollar camera. Out of raw, right action, all the way. We gave him. Mom fucking took out drag and said. Eh. Bam, they had it done in 10 minutes. A nice $320 camera that humanity will help us buy. We're not here to drain fucking humanity. We're here to get the fucking money back for the crystal kids. Not use it in stupidity. Thank you, Father. Go ahead. Rob says, ha, 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 ha. Apparently, wants to show off his foot massage skills. Mom <laughs> says, he has none. We will call him none. <laughs> <laughs> We like whip it. He whip goes, you're it done, retards. <laughs> she said, well, actually, wait, hold on. Let me just make sure because oh, it's yeah, not. 
<laughs> All right. So in response to Rise, uh, he says, PewDiePie avoided a similar scandal by getting his audience to believe he had no legs. Mom says, well, I actually don't. Thank you. Jesus. I do want to share an experience <clears throat> when I first got to mission, when I was first uh, getting to know mom, and I was in the room with her, and she grabbed my hand and looked at my hand as if it was a mother looking at her child's newborn hand for the first time. And I'll never forget her grabbing my hand and looking at it and putting her hand up next to mine and just comparing hands and how similar they looked. And it just brought me back to that like childlike feeling of like connecting with your mother for the first time. And it was so beautiful, I'll never forget. <clears throat> she did talk to me about those Eleni and ugly ass feet. And um, <laughs> it can be pretty easy to distinguish, you know, she was out at the uh, water park and she was blown away by all the ugly feet out there. Because the Atlanteans, you know, they took out Lemuria, they took Mother's Paradise away. And now she's back to take it all back. Yes, she is. Woo! Thank you, Mom. Woo! In response to the PewDiePie comment, she says, I don't have to believe, I know. I'm paralyzation. I try every moment, still the fucking same. What you got? It should be, to be enough for all of humanity to recognize that when God is in bed <laughs> paralyzed, how much of an urgency it is to step up and be the greatest and grandest version of vision of yourself mm -hmm. and support mother. Yep. Aurora says, trust us. If mom could walk, she'd be running fucking circles around everyone. Mm -hmm. Mom says, yup. yep. <laughs> yep. It's crazy. It's a double-edged sword, spiritual dichotomy, because they've taken that away because she's taken all this energy on. <clears throat> and now she's paralyzed in that bed. At the same time, by her having to be in the bed, is giving everyone else an opportunity to step up, because otherwise mom would have done every fucking thing. She would have picked up every single ball that we dropped. So it's a very interesting, like, very interesting thing. <laughs> Nevertheless, we would like it to end for mother, her pain and suffering, us actually step up, make it a reality, be in unity, be the team that mother created us to be, so that she can go home. <laughs> Bring the laughter, come on. <laughs> oh, Hilarion says true, but let's be real. She's running circles around us anyways, lol. Oh, yeah. Which is true. Yeah. And mom says, shut up, fuckhead thing. <laughs> yeah. No matter what God says to you, be grateful. Yep. Thank you. Wow. That actually said something to me. Mm -hmm. Exactly. What a blessing for no matter what said. Be grateful. Larry says, love you, mom. <laughs> Because he is grateful that she's at least talking to him. <laughs> oh, just for the attention. Yay. All right. <laughs> Truly, the ungratefulness is so deep. We have to flip it. Mm -hmm. True that. It's your actions. Yeah. You actually speak louder than your words. Yeah. We can say, I'm sorry. We can say that we're grateful. We can say, I love you. None of that matters if you don't show it. Mm -hmm. And when you recognize it, do something about it. Don't continue the cycle. Hold yourself accountable, or it's not going to change. And don't put it off and be like, okay, I'll do that later. I'll keep that in the bank and take care of it mm -hmm. later. No, that's the fuckery. Exactly. The procrastination. Get shit done as it presents itself. Eliminate it. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's divinity. Get straight on it. Yes. Get the awareness, boom. Don't even wait a moment. And that's how that divine flow starts. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Jerry still says, show us your feet, Buddha, and we haven't gotten to that oh, point yet. No. <laughs> he keeps bypassing. Mom. Transfer. Ah, <laughs> mom is yelling at you. You missed. She's get your. Yeah, so this time, this time, yeah. Okay, let's see scene. Hold it, hold it. We have to watch scene change. You have to see how the viewers see it, Buddha. Just keep holding it. Hold on, we just haven't shut up on the camera. So. Right here, you go. I feel your best. I'm watching it. Uh, we still can't see them though. 
Okay, there we go. Now we're getting <laughs> a look at them. Nasty ass feet. They're dry, they, man. They look like volcanic fucking crust. Oh, they actually really do smell bad. Oh, 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 come on. Everyone's dying right now. Dude, you need to get your hummus stone. You need to get all the calluses. Like, I did. Oh, it grew yes. back. It grew back. <laughs> it's dry out here. Why so LOL, hard? bitch. LOL, says mom to Larry. <laughs> <laughs> Probably Rob. food or two. Is Rob there says he one? lays on the floor and sticks his fucking feet up. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is our family, folks. Says, Ugly. <laughs> 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 Thank you, Buddha, for showing your face. Thanks, Buddha. Oh boy, what else? <laughs> 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 Mom said ugly. <laughs> She's rolling up there oh, now. Just get a close-up. Get a close-up. Close <laughs> <laughs> that was what you say, what she said. Get a close-up. Nasty. Do, do we need to take a picture and put it in the Yippie chat? <laughs> <laughs> that's how we fully in right action. You know, like we could get all angles and then you can really... <laughs> <laughs> dimensions and... Defects. Here you got a background going right now. You need a nice forest scene. <laughs> <laughs> so we can really see his hobbit feet fully and completely. Oh boy. They're not even hobbit feet. Hobbit feet are oh cuter. <laughs> As he stomps on the ground. <laughs> no, my feet are cute. No, but you Rob, feet are ugly. Rob says they're not that bad. It's the equivalent of no, it's cute. <laughs> they're so ugly, it's cute. Oh, I didn't expect that one. Oh, well, expectations are a bitch. <laughs> there, you go. there you go. Thank you. Oh, okay. <laughs> Robin's coming in. Okay. Robin said they're Satan's feet. Oh, they're no. Satan's feet. <laughs> I see now. I see that. I can see clearly now. <laughs> Buddhist Peter, I believe. Buddha, can you run? Can you run? Not with those knees. You can freaking climb monkey balls like a tree. Yeah, he can pinch you. With he can pinch you with. Oh yeah. Well, don't hurt the dog. He <laughs> <laughs> says very high arches, but wide and flat at the same time. Weird, very weird. <laughs> Rob says, "Fuck your feet, Buddha horse." <laughs> oh wow. shit, that's great. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> This shit is deep, I'm telling you. Real deep. Satan. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. The poster feet for the satanic church. <laughs> Transform your feet. Transform, Transform feet. my ugly feet. <laughs> you know how you transform things? By telling them you love them. I love my feet. My feet are awesome. They get me places. They help me do things. They're great. <laughs> That'll only work once you accept just how far. <laughs> 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 ugly ass if I can be. You know what? It's hard and difficult, but I, I love, love, love them. I love, I love them. Love your feet. Yeah, they're ugly. They are pretty ugly. Thank you, Mom. Well, <clears throat> I tell you what, humanity, it's getting easier and easier to surrender because the latter doesn't work anymore. <laughs> no more resistance. Just let it go. Move it into gratitude. The last 48 hours for me have been uh, a lot of just many tear-filled moments throughout the day. Mom says... <laughs> <laughs> I don't suck at Atlantean toes off my radar, nor do I wash whore feet. Decrepit Atlantean whores are us. <laughs> <laughs> I love 
couple of whores are last month. Faith, Faith says to borrow on the waterways, where's Satan feet? <laughs> <laughs> Personally, now. <laughs> no, of course not. Do that. <laughs> I'm going with the good ground. <laughs> <laughs> go put those Satan feet in the dirt. Maybe they'll transform. Maybe you go drag your feet in the dirt. They'll grow into people. Maybe the feet or something. I don't know. <laughs> Love you, funny. Buddha. <laughs> Mom says, Atlante- Atlanteans. Wise up, kiss my ass. You have some making up to do. Get him. Mm. Yeah. I show mom. I show mom that you're flipping it. No matter what you did, no matter what's been done, you recognize it in the present moment and now, and you change. You know, keep making the same, you know, add a right action decision over and over and over and over and over again. And I have been there. Complete stupidity. Probably would have been more soft if I hadn't had certain things happen too. But I, but at the moment then, I judged. And thought, why the fuck is this happening? Well, because I asked for it. Because I asked for the healing. Even if it was extreme. And you all have to accept that within yourself, too. That sometimes the anecdote <clears throat> can hurt even more than the poison has injected it. Um, and mom takes full accountability for everything. So we, we need to do that yes. in all moments. Yes. Mm-hmm. It's, if she's doing that, we need to step it up. Absolutely. 100%. Mom's nice. Mom yeah. says, Atlanteans, wake the fuck up. Kiss my ass. Take your feet, penis, boobs. Go now, 40 horse. <laughs> <laughs> Get him. Get him, Mom. Let's see. And there's another one. Oh, man, if their feet are that ugly, I don't want to see the other parts. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, man. Keep it coming. Don't, oh, don't go there. Don't go there now, Aaron. No, no, right. Mom right. says <laughs> transform or recycle now. Yes. Get a mouse. Someone wanted to switch with Buddha so he can go grab (laughs) I can feel you. He sits there, he's like, I should go grunt, but I don't want to show my feet. Oh, but yours are cute. Aw. Aw. T. You have cute feet. We got feet. T on the other end of the He's like, no. T no, has cute no. feet. <laughs> Everybody showing their feet. I'm not going to Cute feet. How do those rate, Mom? Cute feet. <laughs> yeah, oh, I feel you opened up a portal the other morning where it was... I saw the resistance come up where usually you just start bitching and you're like, you know what? No, I'm not going to bitch right now. Thank you. And I was like, oh, yay! And it, it, it had like a very, very deep, genuine, transformative feeling to it. Thank you. Taylor and I were just like. <laughs> grateful, grateful. For all Thanks for being an example. Thank you. Emma says, who can dance? Mom says. Seven minutes? Oh. <laughs> seven mediums? Seven, you're like, that's oh, seven medium, says? the best yeah. answer. Someone stole my feet, though. Yeah. That's the truth of the matter. Yeah. And humanity has stolen mom's feet by not standing up for love, by not standing up for her. <laughs> we all have accountability and responsibility for stealing mom's feet. That connection to Mother Earth. Yep. Who's next in the hot feet seat? (laughs) (laughs) Returning feet to mom now, thank you. (laughs) Yep, yep. I I heart when mom first really um, started going numb in her feet and not being able to feel them or move them, and uh, us all having a conversation about we'll cut we'll cut our feet off and send them to you, mom. Like you need our feet, we you got it, you got it. And of course we were joking, but there there is a element of seriousness to that and you don't have to cut your feet off and give them to mom obviously she would not ask you to fucking do that but to to stand up and and be the change you wish to see be your grandest version like she's asking you to 
That's how we give her our feet. Move it. Where's the tow truck? Larry! It's no manger! Is the truck coming to take away all Lanian feet? <laughs> as long as that tow truck's coming to take is, along. Isn't it a Lanian feet tow truck? <laughs> Yeah, definitely stand up, everyone. Stand up on your own two feet. Don't keep on leaning on your mother. Don't keep leaning on all of your <laughs> Aaron's about to, oh no. Okay, she got it. Nice. <laughs> 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 Alrighty, get some. That was all your bitches in the rhubarb and that the real quick fast. Yes, pretty no, much, no. thank you. Oh, Rob says if Buddha offered his feet, would you take them, Mom? Yeah. <laughs> we'll wait on that response. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> oh. I have no feet. <laughs> Mom wouldn't want Buddha's feet. Oh. <laughs> I mean, oh. <clears throat> shit. Those feet look exactly like mine. Really? <laughs> Let's see. Mom has higher standards. <laughs> Get him. I, I'm pretty sure these are these are not Atlantean feet whatsoever. He's petting them. Checking them like that. Are they not Atlantean feet? That could clean a little bit more. Shower a dead guy over here. Yeah, oh wow, a little dirty. Oh god, Faith like says it. Larry was waiting for you guys to read his comment like a kid waiting for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> and he does that too. He's just like, is somebody going to see it? Did you see my comment? It's so funny. <laughs> he says, not, uh, that totally means you were. Mom says, lol. Yes, she comment. does. Mom says, lol. Go, mom. I'm glad oh. you're having a good time. Yes. Yes. Beautiful. That's Very grateful to hear your laughter, Mama. And he bounced up and down. Yeah. <laughs> but that, she said that in the mom's reply, as he would, and he does, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mom. Oh, how lovely. Wow. Yeah. Crazy. Crazy past couple of days for sure with everything in the father. It was magical to see Father last night. He, you know, we have the our where mom's room is above, right above where we are, and that also leads up to a balcony, you know, to the larger room. And that large room has a beautiful window that has a very solid reflection. And you can see Father up there, his hair is down, you know, it's at the end of the night, and he's just smoking, and like the smoke's just like trailing up here, and I'm looking back at that, and I'm like, yep, yeah, that's Father right there. There you go. You know, because, you know, it's the thing. Mother's the, the ultimate oracle, and father's also the ultimate shaman. So you can see that in him, in all those Indian lifetimes and things of that nature. He's such a fucking warrior. We're grateful to have him here, finally. Thank you. Thank you, Mother. Thank you. Karaoke heaven coming in. Oh, Woo! yeah. Woo! 16 minutes. Oh. Until heaven karaoke, I know. Get the songs ready. Woo! Well, our songs will be less gayer tonight. So <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, 10%. Let's, let's sing some songs with balls. Oh, yeah. You know? Oh, yeah. <laughs> this guy, he's, you know, you're like, I went down <laughs> to the saloon. I yeah, had a pint yeah. <laughs> and sang a tune. <laughs> <laughs> Busted. <laughs> oh, <God> <laughs> and have grit. You know, mama did. Mama does. Mama Jesus. Come on now. Everyone's got to learn that. You got to go through the trenches in your own way. You really do. So you can get home. You got to have that experience. That is the one thing that has been taken away from many of us is the experience in this lifetime. Yet we've had it in every other one. It's time to bring it on in. Yes. yes.
Anthony says, y'all worship Jesus. Mom says, I worship and serve love. What about you? Yeah, Mom. Yes. We praise love and are grateful for love and surrender to love. Every moment, surrender, so key, so essential. The resistance, you know, that was the big thing that had come up in the past few days was the resistance in the field, and that was affecting mom heavily the one night. This is when the stream went to complete shit, take full accountability for that. And with that being said, this is why I went to the lead. And, you know, I definitely have felt that resistance. You know, I haven't fully felt into whether or not I was just feeling it in the field, it's within myself. I definitely sense a lot. You know, a portion of it definitely within myself and, and some let all that shit go. So that's what it really is. It's hold on to shit. That's your resistance. You're literally holding on to the baggage, the emotional crap that's blocking you up and holding you back from fully releasing anything and everything that doesn't serve. So you can be in service to love, not have all these blocks and all this crap in you. You see, what happens is when you hold on to that shit, it creates holes in your work field. It creates the ability for the lower energies to start, you know, tentacling out of you energetically and attaching to other people, places, things, whatever. And that's when it starts affecting it. You see, mother can see that. Other people can too. <laughs> in moments, in moments. We all have these abilities Especially to give. in the proximity to mother. Um, in our hands. Had just amazing experiences with her. Ama amazing. Yeah, divinity. You've seen the divinity. Absolutely. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And I have had that experience too, not just with Mother, but with even other people who had high levels of spiritual gifts. And as I, you know, getting physically closer to them, I you know that it heightened the experience. And that's, again, that's what the point is, is for us to get there, express that, show that, be that, be love everywhere present, so that our fields itself will then gravitate love towards us, and then it expands that love and makes it grander and greater. And that is why the unity is essential and so important. And it just, it's of divinity, you know, it's universal role to be in unity, to be in one with mother in your heart, together with those that are doing the same. It's very simple. Yeah. It's just <clears throat> reaching a collective goal together. When we are fully communicating with our angels and, you know, and putting mother first so that we can have that angel connection, that's where the true magic happens. Yeah. Because then we actually, you know, can feel into that. And that's what it's really all about is feeling. You know, something that <clears throat> Father had called me out on today. You know, trying to see it all. And it's just going to hijack it. And I, and I have definitely noticed that. Different images and things like that. It's like, what the fuck is that? It's not, it's not love right there. So, you know, definitely feeling however it is your information comes through your angels and just going towards that feeling gotta start here you, know, you don't get just jump up to another chakra you know before you go through the process you know that's it's putting the cart before the horse and you're sure fucking going nowhere that way you're gonna go backwards real fast interesting mm. yeah it's a good time mm. all right <laughs> 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 he just yeah, got that <laughs> Katie Elizabeth asks, my appetite has been less I've noticed. Is that part of it? And yes, love, when we are aligning ourselves more and more with mom and serving her highest timeline and her highest will, we will often feel very similar to the way she feels and experience similar to her experience. And when she's eating less, we tend to feel less hungry as well and eat less as well. And when mom eats and is full and abundant and satisfied, then so are we. Yeah. That's the thing. You know, humanity does not fully feel into mother's experience. You take energy, you suck on someone else, you feel great, everyone else feels like shit around you, you just basically put God in the bed, put her in the corner, <coughs> and you're all... You know, walking on your high horse. Not my problem. Right? Oh, whatever. <laughs> I feel good. It's not real. It's completely fucking fake. 
and it's not going to fly anymore. <laughs> not at all. Shit. I can see it because I've done it. <clears throat> it reminds me of the, the Chad. Chad. You know, uh, it's like a like a broski, bro, Chad. Oh, Chad. Yeah. yeah. Chad. What's up, Chad? What's up, bro? What's up, yeah. bro? Yeah, it was cool. Yeah, you want to go work out? Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> right. Right. Then we're going to party tonight? Yeah. All right, dude. Cool. Yeah, that's not. That's just dumb. It's complete retardation. That's <laughs> Chad. Chad. <laughs> Chugga chugga. Oh yeah. No oh, shit. I used to be that guy. I bet you. But that's funny because I don't even know why I, I had the thought to do that. I was like, why would I do that? I was like, fuck it. I'm just gonna do it. Spin me out. <laughs> I love you. Mom says, Team Timmy, sing Secret Garden. Secret Garden. Yes. Oh, yay. I don't. I'm not sure. If I know. Oh. L. Sing Jailhouse Rock by Elvis. Yay. I love that song, Elvis. You asked for a song with some balls. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. And the list is here, so we can start uh, passing around. Who do you want to do Thanks, top of the list? Thank you, Rob, for reaching out to Anthony. Rob says, Anthony, I'm an ambassador here at Love Has One. If you'd like to message me on here, I'd be more than happy to guide you on who and what Love, Love Has One is. Thank you. We have a lot of wonderful ambassadors all across the country, and we are so grateful to each and every one of them. And mom says, Stacy, true colors. Yeah. Get them, Stacy. You know, we have even more ambassadors, too, uh, throughout the whole entire planet. That, yes, thank you. I did say country, but I meant countries. <laughs> Thanks for that catch up. <laughs> you know, we're always looking for more people to join us and to spread the message, especially in your uh, native language, that the, you know they can actually understand you and communicate with you. So anyone that would like to join that you know speaks a, you know, a different language other than English, we'd really like to hear from you. Yeah. T. Oh, go ahead. Great balls of fire. Great balls of fire. Nice. Yes. Jerry Lee. Oh my. Yeah, All right, baby. Mom. All right. Mom. All right. <laughs> mom on three. Like, Ready, oh, break. Woo! Oh, <laughs> Put me in the game, coach. Let's go. Put me in, coach. All right, so All right. we're going to sing right. Secret Garden. Uh, we got, I guess we're going to... I don't know if we do that I now or wait for Pops. Well, Thank you, you Mama. Yay. Yeah. One of my faves. Okay. Angel by Sarah McLaughlin. That's a great one. I love that song. So much fun. Oh, heaven. Karaoke. Final! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Taylor Frozen, Lots. let it go. Yippee! Oh, uh, wow. <laughs> yeah. I love that song, Mom. Thank you. We are the luckiest children in all of creation to be here. May we always show it, honor it. <laughs> What's so funny? Why are you laughing? Rob's calling out Christian. <laughs> yes, we are all beautiful, divine children, Christian. Just breathe, Christian. You're all right. You have good ground, quick smoke. <laughs> Great. That's just how I'm like, I knew I was going to get someone with that. <laughs> oh shit, I forgot. I got a ground off. <laughs> Fuck no. <clears throat> well, anything else, gentlemen, that you'd like to. I'm still coming back from <clears throat> lifting weights, chugging protein shakes, chugging beer, and crushing them on my noggin. Yeah, oh. you went there for me. Yeah, he, 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 my friend, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, that. that was me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then he's like, oh, no. <laughs> you heard father, you know, we got some things to let go. I'm still <laughs> coming through. <clears throat> The obnoxiousness <laughs> is what I'm most embarrassed about now, because that is just pretty much not me now. <clears throat> you ran yourself pretty far into the, the dirt, and Mom has healed you a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Yes, very grateful. I'm, I'm practically a new man, because I am. Yes, you are. <clears throat> I was a very similar case um, over a decade of heroin and meth use and overdoses and just total self-hatred and destruction. Um, mom brought me back over a dozen times from just 
dying, overdosing. Now I'm feeling grand. Thank you, man. Wow, beautiful. beautiful. Yeah. yeah. You know, a lot of the things lately have kind of been reminiscent of the, like the cute little karate kid movies. Mm -hmm. Like you paint the fence this way, and it's like that's stupid. Like, no, it's not. Because you're getting muscle memory discipline, you're toning up. There's there's a reason for mm -hmm. sure. Uh, Mom says Michael into the field new singing Sweet Low Chariot. Nice. Wow, wow that's <laughs> a great a one. In him too. Awesome. <laughs> Sorry, trying to do last night. Okay, so. Anthony says, honestly, I believe that true love is only felt between people when they will, they all worship Jesus. I say Jesus because I believe he is the only real way. Man falls short and is an abomination. So Lauren says, you mean she, though. Alan says, Jesus is, was a fucking woman. Mom says, Jesus is love. Just choose love. Um, Katie then says, you may be shocked, but Jesus was a woman, and she kept her promise returning to this planet, her heart, mother of all creation. Mom says, I keep my promises. Yes, she does. Madison, and re research the Cathars if you've got any doubts. That would be a good jumping point. And the nuggets, the truth, they will come for you, man. There's no stopping now. Just be open to possibilities and feel. Mm -hmm. For sure. Know that you don't know. I know I'm not crushing beer cans on my head anymore. <laughs> okay, so team, I need assistance with phones because the comments are starting to get a little bit jolted okay. here. Okay. It's not showing up fully. Oh, yeah, so if you can all be on here. it. Thank you. <clears throat> yeah. And everything you've said is coming through, at least on my mm -hmm. phone. Yeah. Thank you. Ah! <laughs> Yeah, there's definitely more more purity in the field. Your father's embodiment and George leaving, George is great for you, brother. We love, love you, George. You. No matter what, please let it all go. But like Taylor was saying, even on some of the simplest tasks, you feel like you'd have to like sludge your way to it. It's like that's finally gone, and we can, we're all kind of synchronistically flowing together. Two minutes, Two minutes to heaven karaoke idol. <clears throat> well, it's gonna be the team one with Secret Garden first. It said Team and Timmy. I feel I feel she meant that that's Timmy's song. Oh, okay. I could be wrong, mother. Okay, like Team clarify. Timmy I is Secret she was Garden. Team. Thank you. Yeah, this is Timmy. Just, Got it. Thank you for that. Um, also, mom has a comment. Rob says, Anthony, we all know who Jesus is. Do you know who mom is? Maybe less talky and more listening. Mom says, fascinating. <laughs> and Rob goes, yes, retardation is fascinating, mama. <laughs> <laughs> Why are they so dumb? Let me have that back for a moment. Still, I'm not, I don't make sure I got the first one set. Yeah. <laughs> it's, just really, it's just making it about you. That's the retardation. Comments are fire. Yeah, good I, comments today. Yeah, I felt more love than ever finding out Jesus is a woman. Makes me want to shout more, says Kay. <coughs> Get it. Mom's still, repli still replying to Rob with the yep, elbow bump. <laughs> it says, retardation is fascinating. Interesting, and Bobby's microphone did arrive. Wow. Oh, we'll see if mom wants to Thank you, Bobby. Tonight. Thank you, Bobby. Okay. Thank you, Bobby. Oh, Thank you, Bobby. Wow. So grateful, Bobby. Thank, Thank you, you mama. Thank you, mama. There are beautiful divine children out there that put mom first. So we're very, very grateful for that. So without further ado, let's bring mama some joy! Let's see, the only one who isn't present for the start of having karaoke is Jackie O. Hope. Oh no. 
Well, thank us. Thank you for gracing us with your presence, Your Majesty. <laughs> Rob says, "Haha, elbow bump, lol. You're the cutest." Mom says, "Lol." Is this you got the phone ready? <clears throat> she is the cutest of all time. Woohoo! Um, Janice says, since father is now in fully embodiment, when is mom and dad leaving? Mom says, immediately. Immediately! Woohoo! Yeah! Get him! Woo! The sooner we leave, the sooner you're going to know how much we love you. So pray for that. Yes. Okay. Do some radical shake up in this bitch. <laughs> Without mom's energy there, you're gonna know it. Feel it. Instantly. What the fuck did I do? Everything's gonna come right through. Please come back. We'll see. Anthea says, has George gone to the forest? Mom says, yes. Yes. Of course, all of our children are fucking divinely important to us. George still made it to mom. He's a, he can be a divine being. He's just young and inexperienced. And we cannot have the things that happened in Florida happen now. Interesting. Where he gets attacked by some energy and all shit goes fucking astray. These oracles and shamans are priceless to this mission. We need to have accurate information moments. Okay. It's all part of the plan. Just Hello by Lionel Richie <laughs> for Daddy Ray! course for mother but daddy reed requested it we want to thank samantha from hawaii for sending mother those beautiful fucking flowers wow oh, they're brilliant wow, wow. thank you daughter so beautiful. Thank we you. love you. Thank you. and you know daddy reed mom will tell the stories about daddy reed and how much he loved his flowers and, and daddy you know did everything to encompass light love and abundance for mom and he grew these flowers that had heads on up this big. And he had every day, he just loves flowers. Love watering the flowers, as do I, of course. You know, just love to co-create and bring that beauty to mom. So we just want to thank Daddy Reed from the bottom of our hearts, of course. Bringing through all the creation in our souls for all the love that you showed mom. Being the only divine masculine on the planet at the moment. To show mom the possibilities, you see, of what she came here to do. We're very grateful to you. I love you, darling. Let's get rolling! Get him. Turn it up a little bit. Maybe we went through this yesterday. Did it's not have to the first year. Yes, it is. It should it's, be working. Yesterday was a blue. Oh, the phone. One day we're going to get it divine. Yes. Until then, I'm not playing. The sabotage kept happening with George. It's not, it's not right action. It's okay. Mom says, love you, Daddy. Thank you. Love you, Daddy. Thank you. Okay, Dusty, Dusty, Dusty. Let's get him, Lionel. You know Mama loves some Lionel Richie. Why ain't you home yet, Lionel? And in my dreams I've kissed your lips a thousand times I sometimes see you pass outside my door Hello Is it me you're looking for? I can see it in your eyes I can see it in your smile all I ever wanted And my arms are open wide Cause you know just what to say And you know just what to do And I want to tell you so much I love you The 
sunlight in your head and tell you time and time again how much I care sometimes I feel my heart will overflow hello I've just got to let you know Cause I wonder where you are And I wonder what you do Are you somewhere feeling lonely Or is someone loving you Tell me how to win your heart I haven't got a clue Let me start by saying I love you says Ash Whitney Houston nothing at all oh. <laughs> thank you mom and then she says first being in my life to tell me he loved me I was nine years old my daddy Reed found me saved all of our lives let this sink in Beautiful. thank, thank you, you daddy thank, thank you, you for daddy sharing Reed. mother hmm? no. Tim's up woo, woo. Get Give big Tim Look at that. Proactive. Beautiful mom. You know what proactive says? Possibility is the cage we live in. Allow mother, who is always one step ahead, to light the way and clear the obstacles. As a proactive being, we have the foresight to always remain on the highest timeline. Step forward with her in divinely guided action steps and evolution is assured. Um, I feel this is to you, Pops. She says, must sing Lady now. Mom. For me? I feel oh, so. okay. I'll sing Lady. Lady. Get up. Yeah, let me take it because more you can <laughs> This thing keeps popping up on this phone. I've asked your kids to not allow it to do that. Happy birthday, Mama! Happy birthday, Happy Mama! Birthday. Happy, Happy birthday, Mama! Happy birthday, Mama! We're singing a song, and the pop-up comes up. You can't see the lyrics. Right. Okay, Mom so. says, "Lionel, lady." Okay. It's sabotage. No. No. 
I'll take accountability and switch the phones out to me. Ryan uh, donated his phone for me. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, we just gotta be on top of things. Mm -hmm. Kids, children. Interesting because it's one I've done it before. The words are behind the left. We just go with it. There's only one verse. Make the days count. The we'll we'll go with it. Yeah, yeah, we do. Nothing wrong. It's Gatorade. Let's get it for mom.
Thank you for your patience. Ashley says, who is Amy and why did she tell you what to do? Mom says, I'm source, love you, get over it now and quickly. <laughs> and then Ashley responds with, get over what? I'm just asking a question. Mom says, you got an answer, now shut your program mind, please connect with soul. I'll do what I want. <laughs> and then there's another comment. Is that Cartman over there? I guess so. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's it. It sounds like a whole world of Cartmans. Teo says, be humble, Ashley. You're speaking to God of all creations. Can you? Mm. Mom says, get him, Teo. And then Ashley says, Teo, I am humble. I'm asking a question. I'm new here. You would think people would be nice and tell me about this. Mom said, are you nice? Are you thinking? So you have a whole <coughs> wide world of creation. They don't want to meet you. Why would extraterrestrials want to meet you? You're just going to question and interrogate them. To appease your fucking ego. If you can't feel it's God, you are here for the first time, then why don't you observe and shut your fucking hole? Perhaps that's what you do when you go to class. You observe that right in class, right? You give that respect to teachers, but you're not going to give that respect to God. Insane. If her name's Jane, it's insane Jane. <laughs> so please, let's move forward. Unless Mother has another beautiful comment. I know she, she loves to toy with these fuckers. I know it. <laughs> yeah, and, uh... and of course, children, the divine ones, we love you. We love those other whores, too. We ain't going to show them no love until they switch up. Of course not. Come on now. See me rolling my ass? <laughs> Real. Uh, it's all about me. No, it's about God. You show her the respect when you come to her site. It's her site. It's not yours. Mom says, insane in the brain. Insane in the membrane. Got insane that. in the brain. You got your song. Your mom said, insane in the membrane. Get him. <laughs> <laughs> One. <laughs> All right. So it looks like first up is going to be Tim with Secret Garden. Get it, Tim. All right. <laughs> Testing, one, two, hello. She looked you in her house. You come back in late at night. She let you in her mind. If the words you say are right. Okay. 
at you and smile And her eyes will say She's got a secret garden Where everything you own Where everything you says Buddha Revolution, hey pretty lady. And Teo says the star beings, most of them are in silence here helping mother. If some choose to talk, so happy this moment turns. And long be waited for in eternity. Mom says you are correct. Love yes, you. Yes, you are correct. Thank you. Wow. All right. Wow. Long time. So up next we have L with Jailhouse Raw. Oh, L, going to the, uh, the Avon factory. <laughs> I'll never forget that moment when Mom slapped me in the face and she was like, Aiden says you know all of his songs. <laughs> it was just the energy about it. I was like, she's never done this to me. I must know all his songs. Of course. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Did you learn all his songs? I feel like it's intuitive. I've never really done a lot of research, but... I no. <laughs> <laughs> she asked him to learn the song for her. <clears throat> okay, got it? Okay. Got it. <laughs> I feel it's intuitive. It's just intuitive. It's fucking intuitive. It's fancy. No, no, not the fancy. Let's throw the fucking fancy pants in the fucking sun. <laughs> fucking <laughs> done. <laughs> Fuck. Well, we don't want to see you naked either. Well, I understand that's true, you know. You ever seen an Atlantean dick? Ooh. Yikes. Oh. <laughs> what? Cheryl's <laughs> like, yeah. Cheryl's like, yeah. Cheryl's like, yeah. Cheryl's like, yeah. Cheryl's like, yeah. Oh, shit. Emma says, I'm ducked. And Mom says, ducked, then he screwed himself. <laughs> Oh shit, I don't know if that makes sense. Did you read all party comments that came with it? Up and down? Yeah, that was it, just two. Okay. Go my ass. Moving along. There we go. <laughs> Murphy played the tenor saxophone. Little Joe was blowing on the slide trunk. Going from 
and the noise and crash, boom, bang. The whole rhythm section was the Purple Gang. Let's rock. Everybody, let's rock. Everybody in the whole cell block was dancing to the jailhouse rock. Number 47 said to number three, you're the cutest jib I ever did see. I sure would be delighted with the company. Come on and do the jailhouse rock with me. Let's rock. Everybody, let's rock. Everybody in the whole cell block was dancing to the jailhouse rock. Rock, rock, rock! <laughs> sack sitting on the block of stone, way over in the corner, weeping all alone. The warden said, hey buddy, don't you be no square. Get out of here, use a wooden chair, let's rock! Everybody, let's rock! Everybody in the whole cell block was dancing to the jailhouse rock. Fifty Harry said to Bugs, for heaven's sakes, no one looking our chance to make a break. Bugs, he stirred to Sifty and he said, Dick Sticks, I want to stick around a while and get my kicks. Let's rock. Everybody, let's rock. Everybody in the whole cell block was dancing to the jailhouse rock. 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 Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Nice one. <laughs> Mom says no Atlantean dick for me. Stay away, poison. <laughs> <laughs> and. Let's see, Emma says, <laughs> love always. Mom says, reserved for all lovers. Shit out of luck. Yeah, those dicks have been cut off. Mm -hmm. You notice any length difference? Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Cut off. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Yeah. 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 We'll be next. Qua Qua will be next life if not. Mom says there is none. No. Oh, that's one of you type of ego, spiritual ego whores that says, oh no, we're just going to put it off. You're going to wait for us to ascend with you. No. No, 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 no. That's why she took away your free will so your words mean nothing when they're opposite of God. Divine will now, children. Love you. Love you, Pops. Love you. Stacy is up next with True Colors. Followed by T. Great Balls of Fire. Cindy Lauper. Oh, you're doing um, some Jerry Lee Lewis, huh? Look at you. Mom said so. Nice. Yeah. So I needed to hear. Mm -hmm. Are you sure you're up to doing it again? <laughs> if she tells me to. Do it. Geico is giving new and current customers a 15% credit on their motorcycle policies with the Geico gift pack. And because we're committed for the long haul, the credit lasts your full policy term. The Geico gift pack, helping riders focus on the road ahead.
for people to see the light in you when they're so caught up in their own shit so um, I a lot of people misjudge me when they first meet me and I have never really had the courage or self-confidence to stick up for myself and say no you can't treat me like this I'm fucking love mom says get him Stacey <laughs> Woo! Tea with great balls of fire. my nerves and you read on my brain you touch much love drives a man insane you broke my wheel but what a thrill goodness gracious great balls of fire I love to love cuz I thought it was funny you came along and you moved me honey I changed with mine this love is fine goodness gracious great balls of fire kiss me baby I want to love you like a lover should. You're so hard, so kind. Got to tell the world that you're mine, 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 mine. I chew my nails and I twiddle my thumbs. I'm real nervous, but it sure is fun. Come on, baby. It drives me crazy. Goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Good. 
love or should You're so fine, so kind Got to tell the world that you're mine, 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 mine I chew my nails and I twiddle my thumbs I'm real nervous but it sure is fun Come on baby, it drives me crazy Goodness gracious, great balls of fire Get him, T. Love you, Mom. That was fun. <laughs> awesome. I'll even do that one again. <laughs> <laughs> Up next is Aaron with Angel, Sarah McLaughlin. You can keep the seats filled, please. difficulties for a moment. Can you help her out, Buddha? Yeah. Yeah. Just turn off the other song. Yeah. Thank you. It's, it's All right, Brian just is singing. Intro music. Brian is singing Tupac Changes. <laughs> <laughs>
next is Taylor with Let It Go Get from it, Frozen. Get him! <laughs> Taylor always gets the pops. <laughs> the pop dings. I am so excited to sing this song right now because this was my my uh, kids' favorite, one of their favorite songs, and they would always sing it to me, and it would always make me feel so good. So. Thank you, Mom. <laughs> Sing it out. <laughs> the snow goes white on the mountain tonight, not a footprint to be seen. A kingdom of isolation, yet it looks like. Mama's the queen. The wind is howling like this swirling storm inside. Couldn't keep it in. Heaven knows I tried. Don't let them in. Don't let them see. Be the good girl you always have to be. Conceal. Don't feel. Don't let them know. So see us Maybe up there. Yeah, we do that every day, don't they? <laughs> Where do we just keep coming back? We better keep up. It says we're still going. Let me slide this off. 
Is Michael. anybody out there? Michael, will you show us your face? Oh, show that face. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, brother. There he is. Uh, let's just double check to make sure. Can anybody else see the what? Facebook stream on their phones right now? I can see the stream, but I'm not getting comments. I'm not getting yeah, comments they either. The comments. I noticed that. Okay. It says we only have 12 viewers. Well, I looked over Jordan and just what did I see? Coming oh, for the care of me. Sorry, we just want to oh, yeah, we just want to make sure because it's still going. So we are going to. Yeah, it's wrong. I just logged into it. Okay, so we're gonna start a new video really quick. We'll be right back so we can hear Michael's full song. <laughs> 